Daily Devotional for Friday, January 21st. Today I'm going to read the Lord's Prayer, and I like to read it making it personal to me. So Matthew 6, 9 through 13. In this manner, therefore, pray, My Father in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on this earth as it is in heaven. Give me this day my daily bread, which is Jesus Christ. Forgive me my debts as I forgive my debtors. Lead me not into temptation, but deliver me from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Now, I want to share with you something that the Lord uh, showed me a few years ago. I questioned why it says, why Jesus is saying, do not lead us into temptation. The Lord would never lead, lead us into temptation. I think what he showed me was a... Um, a way not to be led into temptation because he showed me through uh, in Genesis 4 where Cain and Abel Cain was mad he was angry in fact at God because he didn't accept his his sacrifice and God said why are you angry you know if you don't do good you know if you do good I'll accept it if you don't do good I won't and um God said to him, sin crouches at your door. Okay, this is the door. Sin crouches at your door, but you must rule over it. So that's what I believe that temptation is. The Lord is saying, don't be led into temptation. Rule over your thoughts in your mind. Okay, therefore, you will not be led into temptation. Because the enemy comes at us all the time trying to kill, steal, and destroy, trying to get into this right here. If he can get us off track here, if you're off in your mind, you'll be off in your heart, and, and your heart's going to follow, your actions are going to follow your heart. So rule over your own mind. And tomorrow we'll get into forgiveness. So until next time, be blessed.